Hell, my great Pyrenees will not stop barking. Well, hey guys, welcome back to the channel. You know, here on our small farm, we've got four great Pyrenees and we absolutely love these dogs. They are the best dogs that we've ever owned, but they do bark a lot. They bark a lot. And listen, maybe you're watching this video because you're considering getting a Great Pyrenees or you already have a Great Pyrenees and you're beginning to get frustrated by just how much they bark. Like Mabel's barking right now in the background. One thing you need to understand is this breed, the Great Pyrenees, was bred to bark. They were originally bred to be livestock guardians. This is a centuries old breed that was originally bred to guard sheep and goats and livestock and their primary way of guarding their flock is by barking. See, what's awesome about the Great Pyrenees is they're not a guard dog in the sense that they're aggressive. They will get aggressive if they need to, but by all means, their first method of defense is just to look imposing and to bark. And they're a big dog and they've got a big bark, so that usually works pretty well to their advantage. Now there are many people that keep Great Pyrenees as indoor dogs, as indoor pets, because they are such great dogs. They're so loyal and so affectionate and so loving, uh, but they may not be the best breed if you live in an apartment or you've got a small backyard or maybe you have an HOA or neighbors that would complain about your dog barking all the time because they do <laughs> bark a lot. Now our Great Pyrenees are working dogs. They work here on our small farm guarding our goats, our chickens and our pig and they love their job they they love to do it every single day stay up all night barking at anything that moves making sure that all of our goats and our chickens and our pig are safe it's actually pretty neat what these dogs will do when they perceive a threat and they're normally really good at knowing what's a threat and what's not. Although sometimes Mabel, our girl dog, she will bark at butterflies from time to time. But when they perceive a threat, they will run out towards that threat and bark. But then one of them will swing back around and check on their flock. So they'll check on the goats, they'll check on the chickens, they'll check on the pig. And yes, they'll check on us as well. If we're out here with them on our property, when they perceive a threat, They'll run out there towards the threat, bark at it, try to scare it off, and then they'll swing back around and make sure that we're all right. It's pretty neat how they do that. But then most of the time, they're just perfectly content to sit around and be lazy all day. The goats always let us know when it's about time to eat. Listen to them, they're calling for us. They're saying, it's time to eat. It's time to eat, I'm hungry.
Memphis. Are you hungry? Hey, that is it for today's video we hope that you enjoyed it and if you did make sure you hit that thumbs up button give us a subscribe so you don't miss the next time we post a video we're posting videos every single week we hope to see you again soon